Test one two one two. Test. <laughs> so, uh, Tony. Hi, Fred. We're about to do a podcast in English. Oh, your English is pretty good. Thank you. Uh, no, uh, two French actors doing a podcast in English about two French actors doing a show in English. Yes, that's about right. Let's go. <laughs> d'impro. Une discussion avec les artisans du spontané. Juste une discussion, pas d'impro. Il est original de Frédéric Bambouchi, musique Dominique Hamel. Uh, yeah! <coughs> so far, so good! So far, so good. So, um, yeah, well, let's talk about it, uh, because, you know, yes, we're, we're, we're not used to talk in English. Uh, no, no. English, yeah. yeah, but I, I do speak a bit English. Yes, you and do. And I'm, I'm always uh, looking out for my accent. I don't know uh, which <laughs> accent to take. Which accent do we have? I don't know. A French-Canadian uh, accent? Yeah, but, you know, when I'm traveling around, I'm trying to put <laughs> a twist on it. Ta-ta-ta. Uh, but I'm uh, yeah yeah it's it's uh, that's it's gonna be hard I think. Well, it's gonna be hard to play ourselves through uh, another language, yeah. But uh, I think that characters will emerge. <laughs> yeah, I think so, but uh, I'm I'm afraid all those characters will uh, always be taking time to search words in their head or oh uh, maybe but uh if i do uh i don't know a, a, a kind of semi japanese english talking dude yeah yeah maybe uh, it, it takes a lot <laughs> of uh, um, uh energy uh concentration to you know work character the the story and on top of that Uh, a layer of, of, of another language. I, I, I don't know. I'll, I'll uh, get out of this. First, about, uh, first of all, maybe we have to uh, set the context. Yeah, of course. Uh, so, uh, you are an actor. I, I am. I'm a French, French actor. Yeah. And uh, we did our first podcast with you uh, in French. And um, you said you, were, uh, you left the improv world. Yes, I did. Except maybe once in a while with uh, our show uh, Zito. Yes, I did Zito, which is without any 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 words, words at all. Yeah. So you don't want to, you just don't want to play in French. That's about <laughs> it. No, well, I'm 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 looking for uh, new adventures. Uh, I, I love this this medium, uh, improvisation, but I think I'm I'm too old for this. I, I I'm I've got some difficulty to find new ideas, and I always find myself doing the same things but to play in English that's all all new of course so uh, one think. night I told you uh, yes Antoine I would like uh, to play in New York or I don't know in English somewhere and you said that's the kind of thing I want to do yeah of course to, to, to challenge this uh, I've, I've been doing some improv for a long time now and I, I've got uh, faux pli. I've faux got pli. some uh, <laughs> reflexes. Right, yeah. Uh, and, 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 and to break those, it's, uh, it's hard to break them. But with a context, with, uh, for example, uh, no words at all or uh, doing it in English, I think I'm, I'm, I'll have to do something else. <laughs> I don't know what. In front of... Yeah. Uh, it's like crisis equals opportunity. It is. It is. It is a crisis, and uh, I hope something will uh, emerge of that. Uh, but so, so I told you, yep. yeah, I would like to play in New York, and you said, yeah, I'm down for that. And uh, a few weeks later, I, I, um, I told you, yeah, well, I wrote to uh, the People's Improv Theater, and they said, uh, why not? And yeah, and you said, go. So uh, we're doing it, and we're doing it once in Montreal. The 7th of October uh, of uh, 2017 at uh, 10 p.m. That's late. at 10. At That's 10. a great, yeah. a great yeah. crowd at 10. Great, great crowd. Uh, but we've played with uh, Italians playing in French. Yes, we did. 
Do you think that we're going to experience uh, something similar to uh, what they were experiencing? Uh, maybe, but, but I think we, we speak a bit more English than, than they the do uh, <laughs> French, uh, with all respect. Uh, yeah, there's going to be this, this part of our brain, uh, to, you know, occupied, occupied, I don't know. Uh, to generate this yeah. English language, you see, you see that that, yeah, yeah, that, that I, phrase there. That's <laughs> that's gonna be happening all the time, I'm afraid. Or but doing course, uh, word to word the uh, translation. Yeah, falling to that. Like, uh, like what? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's the one. Yeah. <laughs> my uh, my uh, girlfriend. Uh, Tammy uh, uh, began uh, English courses. Oh yeah, just to see no, our show. No, but it, it was a, a long time uh, uh, dream of hers. Okay. To to she she does speak a bit of English, but now she's learning it. And one of the comment of her uh, teacher is that you know you do speak English, but you think in French. Ah, then yeah. you translate. So we see the you know the mechanism of, of French in your uh, uh, speaking. So I and when we talk about this project and when we uh, text ourselves, uh, I love those expressions. Yeah, that's that's maybe the 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 hint of of speaking a language is those. So I think there's going to be a lot of yeah, uh, uh, you know, expressions, English expressions, uh, uh, things we're used our, to say in French, but we translate in English. So yeah, I don't, I, I don't know. Maybe it's going to be. It, a, it will be cute for uh, the New York audience. All it will be twelve exotic. of them, <laughs> maybe more. Maybe more. A few French people. I yeah, hope. yeah, sure. I'll try to uh, put the word out. Put the word out. That's well, nice. I heard that uh, when you learn a second language, uh, when you start to think in that language. Bullshit! No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do, and you, you dream, dream yeah. in English. I've done some immersion. Uh, courses, so uh, we only spoke in English for a week, and then yeah, yeah at one point you dream <laughs> in English and you do speak in English. Oh, we're we're, we're having a conversation in English. Right I now. know, and that's uh, weird and, and amazing. <laughs> great. <laughs> Why don't we always speak English? I I don't know, and I heard also that when you um, you play in a second language, you have. Other characters, other uh, reflexes. Of course, of course. Um, I, I listened to a podcast from uh, UCB, Upright uh, Citizen Brigade. Okay, it, it's a improv well, uh, cult in, in, in the states, uh, and they uh, they talked about playing in their second language. But well, for some of them, it was his first first language because was mostly Spanish Spanish yeah Sp yeah Spanish and uh, and they uh, they were they said they were more to the point yeah uh, less uh, less uh, how do you say <laughs> what is it so it's, it's, it's just a memo uh, yeah so uh, yeah, yeah we're point. looking for a word for mm -hmm. fioriture uh, less, less of that Less la dida. Da -dida. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, yeah, that might be so. Um, are you uh, up for uh, another podcast? Maybe in French after this experience. Yeah, of course. To on talk about how it. it went and uh, uh, of course I will. I will be there uh, because I think that most uh, Quebec actors and improvisators. Uh, think about doing a show in English because it's we're we're, we're uh, how <laughs> <laughs> this is going nowhere. It's going great, uh, but no, we're in the middle of a notion of anglophones and yeah. and we most for the most part speak English. Most of us, yeah, and uh, it's. Uh, it's a I was gonna say a huge market but we don't do it really for money because no, we would no, be rich we're intrigued by it by it and uh, when when I travel usually uh, uh, I've been in uh, Chicago or Boston or New York I go to see improv yeah to see this other world and there's some in Montreal yeah 
you've got some some contacts with him. Uh, it, it, there's there's a parallel universe there, accessible for us maybe a bit. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm I'm intrigued by it. I told uh, one, uh, I was in contact with some guy from Hollywood. Nice. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we we were chatting about improv, and I it, it, I made the. Uh, Parallel, I don't know what do you say. Why? Uh, about uh, here, it's like the Galapagos Islands that yes. as we evolved differently, differently from uh, the same thing, but uh, without contact with the English improv world. Um, That's very nice, uh, Fred. <laughs> but the the French are uh, are opening up faster than, a hut, than us do they yeah why is that uh, uh well well uh germany and uh yeah, yeah, Italy yeah, course, and that, uh, that contact Spain, uh, and usually when they don't know which language you speak they speak english and, and they, that's, oh yeah, uh, yeah. today oh yeah yeah my god or french french or mandarin <laughs> that's the next step That's the next step. But but we have this this common <laughs> language, which is the, the body language gestures. Yeah. And uh, Zito, you've done it. This this no words game uh, this, uh, uh, show. So I think we'll 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 manage uh, w with that too. Uh, to understand ourselves and. What kind of characters do you think you're going to? Uh, the use silent more. ones. The <laughs> silent ones. Mm -hmm. Mysterious. Yes. Few words. Ah oh, yes. Yes, uh, I cannot speak now. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know. So the show, action. yes, the show we're going to do uh, in New York and in Montreal, it's called Three, 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 <laughs> and uh, it's uh, quite simple. You, uh, when there's an actor uh, who counts to three, well, there's another scene. Another scene that begins. And that's it. That's it. So we've got the, the, the reins of our destiny. Yeah, yeah. And uh, we're always on stage. And we've got a... Always in action. And we have a musician. A musician. With, with great experience. Yes. Dominique Amel. Dominique, <laughs> Nick, Nick. that sounds good. Uh, He's good. Will you do the French-Canadian accent? You know, uh, speak like this and... Uh, yeah, of course, a bit. I, I, why not? Logan. Why not? I, I've got uh, some difficulty <laughs> to do it. Logan. <laughs> oh, yes. there are some people. Uh, yes, uh, ah, we're, uh, we're in front uh, of uh, Radio Cannes. But of course, we'll do one with uh, that accent. We'll that, do yes. one with, without speaking. Without speaking. Maybe uh, one in French. Maybe one in French, of course. Uh, and then uh, we'll in try... In Spanish. In Spanish. And maybe one in English. Uh, true. A true English. <laughs> All uh, the way. But uh, you you uh, lived a few months in... Uh, I've, I've lived in, uh, in, London? in London. I did. I did. But that's a long, long time ago. You must practice. I, I, I've got... My English is, is uh, I think, pretty good. But I, I, I hear English. I listen I read, yeah. but I don't often speak. Yeah. So that's that's the one part of it, and and we're going right in that. Yeah, we're we're jumping oh, in. Oh yeah, we're jumping in. But playing here in Montreal in front of French-speaking people and playing in New New York in front of uh, mostly English-speaking English-speaking people, it would be. I think it's gonna be different. It's gonna be a hard one in Montreal <laughs> because people, I think, are, are going to laugh. Yeah, about just because we're not, not about our stories or our excellent writing. No, not but, at all. Just but, seeing us yeah. look for words. Oh, and he said that that word. Uh, uh, I'm I'm uh, <laughs> I'm backing up. No. No, 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 no. So uh, if you're in uh, New York, 27th and 28th of October. Yeah, come come and see us. Yeah, how's yeah. it called the, the place there? Uh, we're at the Pit Loft. Oh, a people's classic. improv lo uh, uh, theater loft. There's the Pit and the Pit Loft. Oh, is yeah. there? We're at the Pit Loft. And that's better. 
Not really. Yeah, <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, well, there's a red door. And if all goes well, yeah. we'll be in uh, Chicago next. Chicago, Boston. Boston. Yeah, I maybe mean, Boston's nearer. Yeah. Uh, what else? That's about it. Uh, <laughs> South Africa. South Africa. England. Yeah, yeah sure. You've done. Uh, did you play in, in England? In French. In though. French, yeah. Did it influence at all? <laughs> what? Your French playing in England? Well, in front of French be speaking people with French. No, not nothing from France. To, no, no. It was okay. like playing. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, uh, I'm, you say I'm tired. Yeah. Yeah, I've used I've used a lot of energy to, to speak English. <laughs> well, we have uh, an hour long show, so you'll have to manage. Lots of music there. Yeah. <laughs> singing. Singing. Is it easier to sing in English than to speak? I think no. so. People lose their their accent when they sing in English, does it? Yeah. I don't know. Jumping Jack Flash. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Tim Jagger, he, he whoops, uh, who uh, who sings in English, uh, who sings with an almost a, an American accent. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Okay, great. So, Thank you, uh, friend. Yeah, <laughs> anything, <laughs> anything else to? Uh, I don't know. I'm looking for words. Uh, I was no, looking I'm, for I'm a curious. deep conversation about our deepest fears about. Uh, oh, were you? Well, yeah, uh, maybe the, not. The 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 distance. That's why I I, I think Montreal is going to be harder for me. But the distance in New York, you know, if it yeah. doesn't go well or anything else, you know, we'll be laughing about it and just go on with our lives. Well, But here in Montreal, I know, I know, it's that <laughs> damn ego of mine. <laughs> yeah, you're known for your ego. Oh yes, I've got some. Yeah. So, uh, before uh, ending that podcast, I'll uh, say the dates one more time. All right. 7th of October in uh, Montreal, Montreal Improv on St. Laurent Street, uh, 36, uh, 39, say 67, <laughs> I think. Go, uh, uh, go see our Facebook. Prod en stable. Oh, Prod en stable. <laughs> yeah, and, uh, and uh, in New York, 27th and 28th. And uh, don't forget to, uh, if you speak French, uh, you can listen to our other podcasts. And uh, if you don't, you can try. Of course, and learn. And learn. And uh, what's the last word? It's a rendezvous. <laughs> Coup d'état. <laughs> bon appétit. <laughs> Au revoir. <laughs> Ta-ta. Prod Impro est une présentation des productions de l'Instable, une compagnie de création dont la mission est de présenter des spectacles de théâtre improvisé et de réfléchir sur la création spontanée. Pour plus d'informations sur nos spectacles en salle, nos formations et notre direction artistique, rendez-vous au www.prodinstable.com.